Hi there, it's Rob from Tactical Magfed. It's another quick tips video, um, just showing you how to load and unload a T15 mag. Okay, so we have our T15 mag here. Um, just going to quickly show um, anyone out there that hasn't um, got their hands on one of these um, yet, just how easy these mags are to load and, and to unload. So you can, there's a little wind up mechanism on here. Um, you just wind it up until it gets all the way to the top and clicks. You can also use one of these little Allen keys. They will fit in there. And uh, if you've got big fingers, you can just use that Allen key just to get it up to the top there. Once you're done, uh, get a shot of that. Um, so with the mechanism all completely wound back, you then just take your paint and literally just pop it in. Uh, there's um, not much tension on here at all putting these in. But if you want to hold the little tab down. Uh, if you're worried about breaking paint, you can hold the tab down. It does uh, make a little pinky um, sore after a while. Um, so if you're loading you know, a good six, seven mags every every game um, that you're going around. So I've loaded that up. Um, I don't think I can get any more in there. I didn't count how many paintballs are in there. Um, but it's loaded up there. The tension's all fully wound. Um, there's a bit of rattle there. Um, if you're, if you're um, conscious of the rattle and you want to try and reduce it, one of the tricks out there um, that I sometimes do, depending on uh, what the paint's like that day, if the paint seems to be okay and it's not too brittle and breaking, what you can do is um, you just press the release key there. If you, hold on, if you hold on to that, it will stop it from going around too fast. If you hold the release key, and it just takes tension off that spring. And then what you can do, with the balls all tensed there, you just wind it back a bit uh, to get the sweet spot. There you go. Wind it back a couple of clicks. And it kind of raises the ball up closer to this um, release mechanism. Not quite done it, there we go. There you go. So, I don't know if you can hear that, but it reduces that rattle. And there's, it's on spring tension, but it's not, it's not under tension. So that kind of reduces the rattle a little bit there. Um, no dramas at all. If you're um, at the end of the day and you've got full mark, full uh, mags, and you want to unload them, again, it's really easy with these. So you can activate the spring fully, and they'll come flying out. But even if the even if the spring's not activated, you just press the 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 mini the release there. There you go, and they will come out. No dramas. They're not flying all over the place. Um, uh, that spring is still under tension. So if you just put your thumb over there. And just release it off. There you go. So mags are loaded, unloaded. No dramas. No tanks broken. Uh, mags good to go. You can just store that away ready for the next day okay so uh, thanks for watching the video it's just a quick one um, for all those out there that uh, haven't had their hands on these mags um, thanks for watching if you've got any comments um, hit me up below uh, any questions um, other than that thanks for watching hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in another video thanks again bye